play pause button allows, with a simple tap, to start the music or to stop the music. Note that for the play pause button to work, music must have been previously selected from the application. Sonos will not randomly select a track. On the other end, if there is already music playing in another room of your house, you can hold this play button and the speaker will group into the playing room. If there is already more than one room playing music and it didn't join the room you want, you can hold it one more time to switch room. The opposite also work. So if the speaker is part of a group and you don't want to listen music in your room but also don't want to stop the music for the others in the house, you can hold it down and the speaker will leave the group. Now for the volume, it happens on the four point button. To increase the volume, depending on your product, it's done either on the right button or the top one. To lower the volume, it's on the left or the lower one. You can multi-tap it or hold it, it's as you want. By sliding your finger from left to right, you can go to the next track. By sliding it from right to left, you can restart the song that is playing or even go back to the previous song if the service you use allows it. If you have a Sono speaker with voice control, you can also tap the microphone to turn the feature on or off. The lights on indicates that the voice function is activated. If it's off, the voice function is disabled. Now, if you want to disable the touch function to only use the application and prevent any other user from controlling the speaker, I invite you to take a look at the video on the upper right corner. Finally, if you have a Sono speaker with buttons, know that it's possible to do the exact same function. And I can show you how to do it with the video on the upper right corner. So this is it. Thank you for watching. I hope it helps. If yes, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see my other Sonos tutorial, visit my link in the description or just right here. I have a lot of video on the subject. Also, feel free to leave me a comment down below. Maybe you'll give me an idea for the next video. If you're shopping for a new Sonos device, please see my link in the description. And you should also see my video how to choose the right Sonos device for you just right here. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can find me back easily next time you need help. Take care and I hope to see you again, maybe on my main channel. See ya!